I think, uh, first of all, uh, uh, I must say I'm, I'm very delighted to be part of the ING family. Uh, it's, a, it's a great uh, platform. And what's happening in general is that uh, uh, ING globally, uh, or, or from, a, from a strategy perspective, has said that uh, Asia is a growth region and therefore uh, they will be putting uh, more resources, uh, uh, more focus, as well as uh, growing the franchise in, in many ways. Uh, I think the way to compete in financial amongst financial institutions is that you require uh, larger and larger critical mass for an institution to efficiently provide the returns to its uh, own shareholders. And because even the, the cost of running uh, financial institutions, uh, whether it's a bank, an insurance company, and the like, has also increased uh, because of a lot of the monitoring required by the regulators. The economy grows, the demand uh, from the banking sector also increases significantly. And uh, <clears throat> the only way to uh, address that and to also uh, uh, be in line or com be compliant with uh, new regulations is to consolidate, meaning increase your capital base as well. Uh, while at the same time uh, <coughs> uh, competing head-on uh, to new players, against new players like foreign banks, especially in the upscale market or the wholesale banking system. Um, so it's a, it's a natural, it's a natural uh, development that banks uh, uh, consolidate and, and, uh, <coughs> and uh, satisfy the requirements of the growing economy. The economy is growing uh, quite a bit, probably at, at record high stuff for uh, quite some time. That actually opens up a lot of opportunities for us in, in terms of uh, straight fundraising for institutions. Number two would be looking at some uh, specific projects we're in, uh, whether it's a project finance or a structured finance uh, type of transaction. The growing economy uh, as well as the strength of ING will allow us to uh, utilize our own main uh, strengths against uh, a growing opportunity set and hopefully uh, that means at the end of the year uh, we'll have a uh, larger than previous uh, market share. Uh, we've stayed away from it. <laughs> uh, it's, uh, <clears throat> it's something eventually that would uh, affect markets uh, but uh, so far our client base continues to be focused on the normal uh, financial market products. So uh, that's where we are at the moment. You know, but uh, I don't know how for the next five years. There will be, of course, ups and downs and so forth, but at the end of the day, we'll probably see a trend growth that is higher than what we've seen over the past 20, 30 years. With the pace of growth of the economy, uh, we hope that our own uh, uh, level of growth uh, outpaces that 6.7% uh, uh, that Joey uh, had uh, predicted.